Hello wild people, we are back with Planet Zoo and this zoo has a twist. We're only using carnivores to try and get to five stars and it's going surprisingly well. Just don't tell anybody, okay? It's going really well. So today I don't have a clue what's happening. I never know what's happening. If you want to go pot, well, if you want to go and watch a proper YouTuber, then you're probably not in the right place. So, um, I don't know what we're gonna do today. We need to add maybe uh, a new animal. I don't know who to add. We might add another little guy. Yeah, so it's going well this zoo, like surprisingly well. I might mirror that side here. I'm a bit weird like that. I do like my symmetry. Yeah, it's a bit sad, I must admit. So here we go. I'm very excited about this. But welcome to the channel if you're new. Go ahead, please subscribe if you could help us grow the channel. We're starting out and we're trying really hard, um, but we will get there. We will get there. So thank you for all the support and kind comments that I've had lately. I really appreciate it. This channel's all for sort of animal games and stuff like that. We're mainly doing Planet Zoo at the moment and we're doing lots of zoos with twists. So like this one is only carnivores and stuff like that. And we've done a few others, like the last one was using tiny animals and stuff like that. So yeah, go and, go and check it out if you haven't already. We do have a Planet Zoo playlist. So uh, yeah, hopefully you guys will enjoy that. Um, I'm just letting the game play on slightly because, oh good lord. Okay, this is good. This is gonna give us some money. Excellent. Can I afford? Okay, I can't quite afford that thing yet. Um, let's build another habitat one. Let's do that. Let's build it here because that way the animals are right next to the staff sensor. So I've just paused that for a little while. Uh, let's just put it actually in normal mode because hopefully everyone will keep breeding and doing good things there. So um, yeah. I'm really enjoying this, this is great, and I'm hoping we'll have a lot more animal games coming to the channel as well. So if there are any games that you think, oh Lady Ranger, you'd love this, please let me know in the comment section, because I'm um, what is. And it's nice to finally do something where um I'm just really enjoying the games to be honest. I'm really enjoying it. I'm gonna build the staff path to go. I'm not sure what animal to go in here. I do know what animal I'd like. And it and you guys know what animal it was, because I tried to make a noise of it last episode. For those that didn't see that uh, embarrassing moment in my life, then I'll uh, leave a link. Go and watch the other video. It was very embarrassing. That's all I'm going to say. <laughs> it was not great. Okay, the staff path can go around there for a moment, and then what I'm going to do is build a path somewhere. Yeah, they need a lot of space, these animals. You guys can probably guess what we're going to... Or what animal we've got. We will need a lot of space. Uh, let's align to grid. How do we do that? Okay, that's probably enough space. Um, I would like to make sure... That the path is straight i'm like not the path but the fence here is straight because i'm a bit weird like that cool okay as you can see this is how i'd like my zoo to be let's just create a double path there because it does get a bit clogged clogged is such a great word okay here we go so i'm just gonna like yeah you can see how i'm gonna build that enclosure there that's a lot of space. I do not know how much space that is. But it means we can have a lot of said animal. You guys probably guessed. If you can guess what animal it is, put it put it down in the comment section. What animal am I getting to the zoo? You guys always want these animals. I don't know if it's going to be the chilly version. The chillier version of this animal. <laughs> oh dear. But we've got to have some real cool stuff. Like lions. And tigers and other cool things, you know? Nice one. Yeah, we'll just build like... Oh, yeah, a little habitat gate there. Okay, let's see how much space this is. Woohoo! 2,000! Excelente! That's exactly what we wanted. So, the viewing space for these guys is going to be... Ooh, maybe down here? I can't remember if they like a lot of space. I can't remember if they're like nervous or not. But you guys can probably guess. 
what animals we're gonna have. So let's just edit this barrier. Again, I don't know what like level of barrier they're gonna need, but yeah, we'll just make this all glass down here. Let's do that. I am so hungry right now, guys. I do not know what's wrong with me. I, oh, mechanic has not attended. Yes, you, you can say that again. Because if you guys didn't last watch the last episode, the these little guys were naughty and they escaped just as I was about to shut up shop. Okay, off to animal trading. Now, last episode, if you guys didn't see, I actually, um, I put in all the carnivores on the species list. So like, yeah, I'm very tempted right now. <laughs> Arctic wolf, my friend. And I'm gonna buy everything I can. Any other Arctic wolves that are female, I'm going for it. Oh, there's nothing else. Excellent. I got a little pack here. Arctic wolf. I've not had these yet. I don't know if they're going to be high maintenance. I do know that they'll need coolers. We learned that from last time, didn't we? Where do coolers? Yeah, so let's put coolers in. And hopefully it won't like bother the other animals too much. Hopefully not. Because actually... Yeah, we've got like lizards next to that. So let's just start. Uh, let's get the range down slightly there. Okay, cool. Arctic wolves are coming. Here they go. Here they come. Oh, my first ever one of these. I'm so excited. Yeah, let's put all snow and stuff in and actually make it look like a snow environment. Let it snow. Let it snow. Oh, do you know what would be really cool? If I was really good at building, I could do like a Disney themed we could do like a disney themed uh zoo and we could have like a frozen like it could look like frozen and you could have all like wolves in there you know I'm just gonna change i thought i did this i thought i changed the opening hours oh there we go because it's really annoying when it's like suddenly dark can't see a thing okay let's go with what do they like a lot of let's put let's put a basis of rock down and then we'll kind of go from there. I know it's a bit scruffy, but we'll just put rock down first and then we'll build everything else on top. So what I'll do is, let's get the soil. We'll make like a path. I do like making paths, again, because I'm really sad. Uh, we do need a drinking water hole thingy for them. Yeah, let's put that in and I do, yeah, that's cool. And then we'll put rocks and stuff around there as well. I used to do this with The Sims all the time. Look at this navigatable land. It's still not at the full. So actually, we did need a lot of space for these guys, which is which is good. I might undo that water and put less water in then, actually, because I have a horrible feeling once they start having puppies and stuff that they won't have enough space. Okay, that's a bit smaller. Okay, every little counts, guys. That's all I'm going to say. Okay, let's put in the Arctic Wolf. I'm getting all ahead of myself I think let's put a large food tray in over here nice one and oh they're so cool we just need loads of these in our life I think they can have quite a few let's check out how many arctic arctic wolf arctic oh no it's stuck now why is it not working let's just scroll like a crazy person arctic wolf Oh, you can have only up to eight. Okay, that's okay. Oh, we've got three in here. That's a good start. Okay, I got very distracted. I think we need to sort out the terrain first. I got distracted by shiny stuff. Okay. So less rock, more soil, which we can probably add some more soil in. What? I'll, oh, my mouse has gone mental. Let me just like dot that a little bit around there and a D bit of grass just dotted it in there a bit too much rock on the go apparently but once we get some more uh snow oh no too much grass now guys oh no i'll put a bit of sand in i do like sand i think it makes the place look good Whoa. oh no too much sand now more soil more soil folks Okay, everything's in the green there. Oh, okay, excellent. Okay, we've kind of cracked that then. I will just put like a bit of rough rock, I think, just like around here. Make it look a bit more, I don't know, like a watering hole, I guess. 
Okay, let's... So now we've done that, they need a hard shelter. And I'm not sure what sort of shelter they can have, to be honest. So let's go to habitat. Now we've put in the arctic wolf. What shelter can they have? Be nice to make them a wolf cave thing. Um, but maybe for now we'll just use one of these big ones. I would like a big... Yeah, like a big shelter for them. That way we we know we've always got enough shelter when it comes to like... When they have babies... Nice! That's cool. Oh, look, a dog ball. They can have a dog ball. That's good. And we have other balls, like a weird pumpkin ball. A sprinkler. Okay, are they going to get hot here? Do I need to put in... Oh, my goodness. Come on. I'm going to need another one of these, aren't I? I do want to put snow in. That's, that's kind of what I wanted to do, actually. That was the whole point. Man, I'd lose my head if it wasn't, like attached to my body apparently we're low on cash we're not low on cash compared to what we have been in the past if you guys want to see a zoo that was well i put it in hard mode these are all in medium mode at the moment because i'm a wimp um yeah if you guys didn't see uh i'll leave a link to simba's place go check that out that was disastrous where should i put an animal talking point let's put it like here We'll put like those in. Because I think the Arctic Wolf is going to be pretty popular. Nature. Oh, yeah. Let's get some snow rocks. I love snow rocks. I think they look great. Snow rocks or tundra rocks? Oh, tundra rocks. Is the Arctic Wolf tundra? I think it's... Is it? I don't know. Let's put tundra rocks in. Because I don't get many snow animals. <laughs> snow animals. In. So, we'll just put some rocks and stuff in. Make it look a bit like better <laughs> hopefully gotta be careful not to spend too much money on rocks i do this a lot i do this a lot and then next thing you know i've got no money because i've spent it all on silly rocks okay let's have a look at the oh you can get like these random trees let's make a little we can actually make like a little woodland type area thing over here perhaps and we can fill it out with these Big old trees. Could have like a tree bit. Do you know what I mean? Is there a smaller tree? Stick that there. I imagine they don't need much coverage. And I imagine I've just overdone it. Oh, they can have endless coverage. Really? Really? What? No, surely not. How does that work then? The, the Arctic wolf. I suppose they're in the woods and things, aren't they? Let's add all these little flowers. Flowers in. That looks rubbish. Let's get rid of that second. Huh. Well, I'm not complaining. Some of the trees do look kind of cool. Like, this tree's cool. Let's add... Huh, see what I did there? Cool. Oh. Yeah, that's not looking funny, Lady Ranger. Okay. Let's add these flowers and stuff in. Make it look really nice. I think this is going to look pretty cool, this enclosure, actually. Yeah. Add some more trees. Have I missed any? Yeah, giant cedar wood thing. Look at this. How did I miss all these trees? Like, what's actually wrong with me? <laughs> Add some trees and bushes and stuff in here. This looks great. This looks really good. This is excellent. Nice one. Look at this. What type of bush is that? This is going surprisingly well. And I still have, like, quite a bit of money, which is not like me. Put these little plant things in everywhere. Yeah, it looks cool. What do you guys reckon? Do you think this looks okay? Or does it suck? Let me know. Tell me if it sucks and then I'll cry. Okay? I do like the fact, though, that we can put endless coverage in. I think it looks really good. We, we should put a Christmas tree in. Let's do it. I put a Christmas tree in. Hee <laughs> hee So happy about that for some reason. It's making me very happy. Put some more plants in. I think it looks nice. The wolf looks kind of happy, which is great. Put some of this in. We do need donation boxes very quick, like really quick. Because people will be around here quite quite suddenly, I think. Be nice to, we could do like Arctic Zoo, tropical zoos. I do want that, that what red tree thing in. That looks great, that red cedar tree. I feel like it's a bit big, but 
I think it's cool, you know? I think it's really cool. Okay, do you think I've done enough with the trees now? Maybe we could put like all that in it. it looks like really cool. Okay, right. Let's uh let's crack on. Let's crack on. Uh habitat, we need more poison things for them. But let's just pause the game a second. And we'll put the stuff in. Yeah, because look, there's a bloke here already having a lovely time. So let's put all the like boring stuff in. So we need a speaker. We need a conservation board of ten of those. We'll go with white donation boxes. I'll just put donation boxes in everywhere. These are going to be a high ticket animal. So I'll make sure we've got plenty of donation boxes on the go there. And lots of education-y things. People must get educated. I can't believe we've had wolves. Did you guys predict wolves from my weird noise I made? In the last episode? <laughs> Yeah, I do apologise. It's probably scarred you all for life. Okie dokie. Right, we'll press play again. Let's crack on. Putting these board things everywhere. Nice. Love Planet Zoo. I feel like I'm really getting the hang of it as well. Like, I, f I think I'm getting better at the game. What do you guys think? I'm just not, like, really good at building. Like, have you guys seen this YouTuber called Rudy? Uh, R-U-D-I, you spell it. It's so He is so good at building. It's insane. You need to check his channel out. Go check out Rudy. Oh, no. What's going on now? Animal pro... No, these blooming blue things. Ah, you guys told me... Hold up. How do you do... Hang on. How do you... Hold up. Select... How do you sell the offspring straight away? Let me do this. Maintenance. Ah... Uh management oh managed population i didn't know this why did i not know this what an absolute plonk managed population animals exceeding yeah managed population will i get money for that or not because yeah I, I can't do that myself managed population for goodness sake why am i so slow with stuff Hey, this is why you guys are here, right? For, for moral support. Just gonna put those two down. Let's really, the quick trade's good, yeah, because you get quite a bit of money for them. Okay, so they automatically should sell now. Hopefully. Let's see what happens. I'm so happy with my Arctic Wolf, though, guys. This is crazy. Can't believe we did this. I feel like we need an Arctic theme. Maybe we could get the Arctic Fox back next time or something. But we're going to need food and drink stands like here as well. So I might put food and drink here. Might do that. Let's align to grid. Let's get a couple others. And actually we could probably... Let's head off down here a bit. Yeah, we can add maybe food and drink there. That's not a bad idea. And then the staff path. Can path. Queen's English, darling. Queen's English. Let's deselect the grid because that won't... That would just will not fit. Okay. Yeah, we can put some stands and stuff in there oh i'm so happy with this enclosure it's beautiful oh look at them all chilling out see i made that noise oh this coffee is so vile okay come on enrichment's not great so we probably should put okay then our monitors hey we've done well there the Nile Monitor is overranked, the Arctic Wolf. So people would prefer to see the little Nile Monitor lizard thing over the wolf. Really? Like, really? I'm surprised by that. I'm just going to go to Animal Trading and see if there are any other Arctic Wolves. Ah, oh, yes, excellent. I mean, we need like one that's really got... I think that's probably our best one, isn't it? I was going to select just the Arctic Wolf for a minute, but oh gosh, it would take me ages to then reselect all the others, so I can't be bothered to do that. What animal do you guys want to see in it next? Let me know, let me know. No monitors eating guest food. Excellent. That's really helpful. Let's uh, Arctic Wolf and link some seating, and then we'll theme some of the seating maybe here, put some rocks and stuff in. Again, I think I'm desperate now to actually build a pretty zoo. Am I? Will I stick it out though? Because I'm really lazy. 
when it comes to actually building really good stuff yeah like delady signer is it delady signer she's really good and rudy's good i'm trying to think of other ones do you guys know any other good like planets of youtubers <laughs> me <laughs> i don't think it's me oh dear i'm trying another arctic wolf has arrived in the zoo which is excellent i'm just like theming this out trying to make it look half decent half decent my friends what's wrong oh okay that's just you okay i'm not too worried about that many guests guests think the ticket price is over or under rather that's good Aha, we're getting somewhere guys so i'm just doing all the boring stuff i don't know why i'm doing this but it's making me very happy doing all this so i'm just gonna put in like the odd tree and things because i think it looks great look yeah we can make like a little foresty bit here i think that would look really nice <laughs> i think it looks good i probably wasted hundreds of pounds now just like putting in trees in this bit which is really sad but i'm having a lovely time doing it so you know just put in all these cool little trees and stuff look at this this is great hopefully people will appreciate my little woodlands bit i've created so people can actually sit and enjoy the wolf fork in a very themed in a very themed way yeah that actually looks nice yeah apart from this tree sort of hold up let's just see if we can move that around a little bit so it's not interfering too much yeah i like that i think it looks great and then we need food shops that is one thing we're gonna need food shops low on cash yes we're always low on cash let's go and see our profits in the merch shop. oh no vendor where are all my vendors this is getting a little bit silly now like really silly i have like no vendors with anything they're all being super pooper lazy i feel let's up our profits slightly here see if this will help but yeah i think the arctic wolf's been a really good addition to the park okay let's just sink renise all that okay we need more food and drink i might put more food and drink down there as well food and drink seems to be the actually the most important bit weirdly let's go check out our wolves see how we're getting on they are beautiful first time ever having arctic wolves literally are even like playing on my own like at home on my own where i'm not recording it for you guys oh it's coffee been successful today that i've even drunk this coffee to be honest should we see how the habitat research is going let's have a look oh look there's some more things for them and i will put their enrichment by the boards so more people will then come forward and see the wolves and uh hopefully they get educated quicker yeah if you put the enrichment by the boards that helps for sure i just love these animals i think they're brilliant but that's it for today guys we've added wolves it's gone surprisingly well i think that's all we're doing today I think maybe, do we need more vendors or do you think that's a recipe for this disaster? I don't know. I just want to say a massive thank you to everyone who supports the channel. If you could do me a massive favor and like the video, it just helps us out because we're, we're growing very slowly and that's fine. Uh, but if you could help us just, yeah, boost us up in the algorithms by liking the video, giving this a thumbs up, I'd really appreciate the support and help. Maybe share the channel to some friends or something as well. That would be, that'd be great. Oh my goodness, look at all the rubbish. So yeah, guys, thank you for watching. Have a wild rest of your day. And please let me know in the comment section below what animals you'd like to see in the next episode. I am pre-recording though, so sometimes I miss things. And also, if you have a zoo with a twist in mind, then let me know in the comment section. I'm all is for this. Thank you guys so much for watching. Have a wild rest of your day. And hopefully then I'll see you in the next one. Bye. I'm gonna put a load of bins in. This is my job for life, apparently, now.
scruffy people. Wait, are they seen the wolves here? Weird. 